Samata is a UK-based meditation charity with centres in Wales and Manchester. There are also Samata meditation groups throughout the UK as well as in Europe and the USA. Samata offers beginners classes all over the country and is part of a Buddhist tradition, although students do not need to be Buddhists. What we offer is a form of meditation which is known as Samatha, uh, which is specifically about the development of calm and using specific lengths of breath, and it's quite a systematic process. In the past I'd practiced meditation and it had been really helpful. So I just googled like local meditation groups and I found this one. There's been a kind of building of evidence showing the benefits of meditation and mindfulness practice and it's, it's become uh, interesting to lots of people and I was I was one of those people I think. So I'm a meditator now for about, ooh, about 25 years. I came across a poster when I was at Manchester University and went along and found that this is exactly what I was kind of looking for, so I haven't looked back since. I discovered Samatha Meditation um, because I was doing a life drawing class uh, in the place that it was, like a community centre, and I just saw a poster on the wall. I thought I'd like to try a group and meet and interact with some people and that maybe I'd get something out of that that I couldn't get just out of a book or uh, talks online, that kind of thing. Beginners classes, which are open to all, offer systematic instruction over a period of months as well as the opportunity to discuss the practice on a one-to-one -one basis. I was a little bit apprehensive at first. I kind of um, thought, you know, am I going to be able to sort of sit down in a group of people that I've never met before? Am I going to be able to be at ease? Well, the teacher's brilliant. He's really warm and clear, um, really approachable. Whether or not you've been coming here for six months or six weeks, it really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you're not a Buddhist, it doesn't matter um, if you have affiliations to a different religion, um, it doesn't really matter if you're not that interested in religion at all. Um, meditation has something to offer. Over time, the effects of the practice become evident not just while sitting in meditation, but also in daily life. Indeed, without this, the practice would have limited value. We have all these different things in our lives that help us to deal with stress and difficulty, you know, going for a run or you know, any sort of sport. We do yoga and these sorts of things and Tai Chi, and kind of they're almost physical meditation, they're kind of movement meditation and the sort of practice that we do is more kind of a seated practice and actually learning to kind of close the mind and engage with the breath and it it's kind of can become part of a package of things in your life. To get the real benefits of meditation it's like any skill you will have to practice. With as open a mind as possible, I think, I think it has potential benefits for anybody. It's very much about integrating a meditation experience into normal everyday life. You do begin to see how very uh, busy and jumpy your mind is the rest of the time. Sorry, my mind went blank. Hold on. <laughs> Great. <laughs> That's what you want. <laughs> yeah. Get with the practice. <laughs>